Please subscribe for more videos and press the bell icon to get regular notifications. Hi everyone, my name is Aditya Prasida Legal and welcome to my YouTube channel. So this is the part 4 of the Ryan Cardino robotic kit and I have already done 3 parts of this robotic kit. So in this robotic kit, there is Arduino Uno which controls the robot. Arduino Uno is a microcontroller. So in this already done three parts of this robotic kit. In the first part I did the basic assembly of this robotic kit. Second part I made a line following robot. Third part I made a DDMF robot which is a smartphone control robot. So if you're new here please subscribe to my channel. I upload tech videos, product reviews and art videos. So let's start with the part 4 of this Arduino robotic kit which is a PC control robot. So to make this PC control robot you need just need a basic construction of this robot. I uploaded that video in the part 1 so you can go check out my video in the description of this video. And if you want to buy this robotic kit, you can buy it from the description of my video. So let's get started. So first I'll be connecting my Arduino to the laptop. This is the Robo India website. I'll be providing this link in the description of this video. Here you will find the tutorial. So after doing the basic construction that I told you in the part 1 of this video, I've done it. You can check it out in there. Then you have to test the motor connection. I've already done this in previous videos, but I'll be showing it this in this video as well. So to test the motor connection, it means that if both the motors are moving in forward direction. It is said that it's difficult to find ground and positive supply terminal of motor transfer the following code to the Arduino board. The robot should move in forward direction. If not doing so, interchange the wire of the motor. So I'll be showing you how to do that. So first, you have to download this sketch from here. You have to open the forward robot motion code. So this is the power robot motion code to just upload it. Sometimes it can show error over here or problem uploading. So I'll also show you how to solve that issue. Problem uploading to both. So I'll tell you how to solve this issue. You have to go to tools, port and just select the port. Then one second we try uploading. It should upload properly. So the code has been uploaded and you could see that uh, both the wheels are moving in forward direction. So if this is not doing so, you have to change the terminals of the M3. This is the M3 terminal, you have to interchange the wires. So you have to just interchange it and it should work. So that's it. Now we'll upload the PC control robot motion code has been uploaded. Now I'll be downloading this code. You can download it from here. This is the PC control robot code. Over here, if you have some trouble uploading, just need to go to tools, select port, com6, upload, and should work fine. Now the code has been already uploaded, so you have to go to Tools, Serial Monitor, and over here F is for Forward, you have to enable Caps Lock, otherwise it won't work. So when you enable that, the robot is trying to move in forward direction, S is for Stop. Now the robot has stopped its wheel, R is for Right, the robot is trying to turn right, F is for Forward again. L is for left and V is for backwards. S is for stop. I just stop the robot. So that's how this works. This is a simple PC control robot that you can make. And my next video will be going to be an advanced video. In my next video, I'll be making this robot, which is an obstacle avoiding robot. It will be going to be the part 5 of my video. It's an obstacle avoiding robot. It means that it will avoid obstacles. So if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.